to 911. Can you please fire EMS? I need someone to come to my house. I need someone to come to my house now. That 911 call was the start of a deadly officer-involved shooting in South Austin back in late December. A Travis County Sheriff's deputy shot and killed Roger Tyrone James during a domestic violence call. Today, a grand jury cleared the officers on scene of any criminal charges. But KXA and Shannon Wolfson shows us investigators are releasing new information. Austin 911, can you please fire EMS? I want to come to my house. I need someone to come to my house now. Just after 3 a.m. on December 28th, a woman named Kim calls 911 from this South Austin home, whispering as she hides in the bathroom. Her boyfriend, she says, is drunk and violent. Yes, yeah, hit you, Kim. Has he hit you? Kim is able to sneak out of the house and gets into a now waiting Austin police car. Soon, her boyfriend, Roger James, walks out the front door and points a semi-automatic pistol at officers. Deputy Theodore Ramsey shot James with a shotgun. APD officer Justin Berry also shot and missed. One, two, three, four, five. You can hear him trying to give James CPR. We looked out the window and we saw the cops trying to resuscitate him and figured it wasn't working, and then it kind of set in. Nick Smolik lives next door. He was always a nice guy, always making jokes, having a good time. I mean, I've never seen him get mad or anything like that, so I don't know what the deal was that night. That night, investigators say James had a blood alcohol level of .22, and he was facing a trial on charges of indecency with a child. What's his name, ma'am? Roger James. Her neighbor says Kim moved out of this house shortly after the shooting. Now, at the time of the shooting, investigators said they believed this was a suicide by cop, that James was intentionally trying to get officers to shoot him by pointing his gun at them. We're live in the studio. Shannon Wolfson, KXAN, Austin News.